and today we're going to make an easy beginner crochet dishcloth. This is the left-handed version. If you want to see the right-handed version, you can find the link in the description box below. For this project, you'll need 100% cotton yarn. I'm going to be using this yarn by Peaches and Cream. This color is called Spring Blue Stripes, and it's a medium four weight. Normally I use sugar and cream yarn for dishcloths, but I find peaches and cream a little bit easier to work with, so for demonstration purposes, that's what I'm using today. You'll also need a size 8 or H 5mm crochet hook, a pair of scissors, and a yarn needle. This is an easy beginner project, so we're only going to use one stitch, the single crochet. So we'll start out by making a loop, and inserting our hook. To create tension and help control the yarn, I wrap the yarn around my pinky finger and over my index finger like this. We're going to start by making a chain of 21. So we'll grab the yarn with our hook and pull it through the loop. We'll do this 21 times. Once we have 21 chains, insert the hook into the second chain. Pull the yarn through, yarn over, and pull through two. You've just completed your first single crochet. Do it again in the next chain. Insert your hook, pull the yarn through, yarn over, and pull through two. You'll do this in every stitch down the row until you reach the end. When you reach the end, you're going to chain one. So yarn over and pull through the last loop. Then turn your work. You'll notice that if you turn your work so that you see the top of the chain, it's a row of V's. We're going to insert the hook into the first V chain. Pull the yarn through, yarn over, and pull through two. This makes your first single crochet in this row. Go into the next chain, pull the yarn through, yarn over, and pull through two. You'll work a single crochet just like this in every chain down the row. When you reach the end, you're going to chain one. So yarn over and pull through the last loop. Then turn your work. And we're going to make 
20 rows in total. At the end of each row, chain one and turn your work. You'll notice that the last chain loop may be very small or look different. That's okay. Don't forget to work a single crochet in this chain too or your work will be uneven. Sometimes you'll have to push your hook through and work your single crochet. Once you've made all 20 rows, chain one, pull the yarn through and cut it, leaving a short tail. Thread the tail into a yarn needle and work it into the loops to secure it. Then cut off the excess. Do this for both ends. And that's it. Now you have a single crochet dishcloth. I really love the way single crochet looks. It looks so complex when it's really the simplest stitch you can make in crochet. Best of all, these dishcloths make great gifts and you can also use them for your face, for a washcloth, there are so many possibilities. Okay everyone, thank you so much for watching. Please remember to like, comment, and subscribe and I'll see you next time.